Once again, I am at the Scouts Wild Day, which is where Scouts from all over Australia and all over the world are all gathering in one spot in Tasmania. And I'm doing some painting with them. And I'm sort of encouraging them to pelt stuff and uh, use power tools. Today we're painting Martin Cash. Now Martin Cash is a Tasmanian bush ranger, an interesting character. He was transported out to Australia for housebreaking. Now his story is that he shot this guy in the backside because this guy was seeing a girl that he liked. And he seemed to get into trouble with the ladies somehow. He was constantly escaping and he got a group of guys together and they formed a gang and they were bush rangers. And most of the time didn't ride a horse, most of the time was on foot. But he was known as the gentleman bush ranger because they didn't beat people up. They just like took their money and ran. And the thing with Martin Cash is he was a likeable guy. People tended to like him. Uh, he was sort of jolly, happy sort of a guy. As I said, he gets in trouble with women and a woman that uh, his partner was messing around in Hobart Town. And that's what brought him out of the bush into the town to try and he was going to shoot this guy that's messing around with his lady and that's when uh, a bit of a gunfight came out and one of the police officers got wounded he ended up dying martin cash was tried and sentenced to death by hanging one hour before he was actually hung they changed the sentence and just gave him a life sentence he ended up being a model prisoner and ended up living out to a nice old age and marrying again. I find it interesting that, especially here in Australia, we tend to make heroes out of rogues. And I think it's probably because a lot of us are from convict stock and a lot of us knew that, you know, the upper classes and that, they were a bit rough on us lower class people and it might be just a little bit of that or it might be that we just enjoy the good larrikin spirit. Either way, the notorious characters like Ned Kelly and things like that they are the ones that we remember in history. I find that interesting and possibly a good uh, topic for discussion. Should we make heroes out of these rogues? Should people like Billy the Kid, Jesse James, Ben Hall, uh, Ned Kelly, Martin Cash, should we idolise them? Should we make heroes out of them? Should they even, they even be remembered? For some reason, if you're a bad boy, history likes you. Martin Cash, well, as Sir Percy Fauntleroy, Chief Magistrate in Van Diemen's Land, I do not think this man is a gentleman bushranger at all. He is just a mere cattle duffer, a common thief, and the term gentleman should be reserved for people of my breeding and my position. I cannot see that anything about his whole story is worthy of any form of commemoration at all. To think that an artwork in future might be made of this man is simply ridiculous and in not in keeping with British fair play. We members of the aristocracy should be the people that are commemorated in great works of art, not common criminals. And that is all I have to say on this matter. Good day. Yeah, we're rolling. Let's go. Beautiful on the next one. Finished. Let's have a look. <laughs> 